Hello Aquarius, welcome to Creative Intuition Tarot, my name is MJ. This is your reading for December 2021, let's see what's up with you. In the last month of this year, starting off with the Eight of Coins, uh, that card represents you, the overall energy. So you're focused, working on something, polishing your skill set. And then we have the Emperor, the Ten of Cups. Three of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, so absolutely, you are focused, attentive, diligent towards mastering something and to towards a certain result, outcome, destination. But the Eight of Pentacles, that is a card of diligent, attentive work. All right? Um, not trying to rush this work, not trying to take any shortcuts, really diligently working to become better and better to polish uh this something that we work on it may be related to anything you may be working on a relationship it can be something money related it can be uh, related to your home environment your business your creative projects you name it you know your situation best but you're you're practicing and mastering something and all this reading is about this you mastering something a skill a talent a business, a creative idea, uh, knowledge, something about your professional um, sphere of life, okay? Three of coins that is next to it. Polishing your skills and talents, practicing. This is the little prince tarot. Remember he was drawing those uh, boa snakes open and closed, right? And in the book, actually, this, this guy, this pilot, he gave up drawing because when he was six, his drawings were not understood by um, the adults, right? Uh, his closed snake was uh, seen as a hat. So he gave up on his childhood dream to be uh, an artist, perhaps. I feel that you are working on something that, that has been a long-term dream for you, maybe something uh, rooted in your childhood, maybe something you gave up on and you are finding it again in your life and this time you are taking this dream up, okay? That's what I think and I really like this. So both those cards are you really focused diligently and look with the Three of Pentacles, there's a kid drawing in the Eight of Pentacles that's already a, a more matured, but still a young guy. Uh, resources are growing. Talent is growing. The more he practices, the better he becomes. To the emperor. So from young kid, um, like a young adult towards a, a mature man. There's a growth, right? The more you practice, the better you become. But there's something about taking up uh, a dream that you had in the past that you may have given up on. And here in this um, Emperor card, you see we have the Emperor. And what is unusual for this card is that there is also this young guy. This is the little prince, right? Sleeping on the throne. And actually the Emperor is sitting next to him. He's not sitting in his place. Um, you are the emperor and you are this adult mature person it's not age specific it's not gender specific but you are the emperor of your life but at this time i feel you are allowing this inner child some kind of dream from the past dream of the childhood or you're just creative youthful spirit you allow it to rule your world at this time your life your empire and that's why you are picking up dreams from the past childhood dreams um, and you are putting your attention, it's giving you a lot of pleasure, I feel, and, and that creative joy and carefreeness that we have when we are kids. So you are still that mature adult person, but your inner child is taking the lead. And I absolutely love this for you. Uh, Knight of Pentacles, the slowest moving knight in the tarot deck symbolizes that you are moving diligently. That's what I already said rationally logically with the emperor vibe as well you are not looking for shortcuts you are taking things slowly uh focused on the direction on the destination this time you are uh fulfilling this dream you are not giving up on this dream 
ever again, right? Just as you may have done in the past. You are determined to make this dream come true. And you are very happy with the Ten of Cups. You are having a lot of fun, as I said. That's creative, but that may be also very spiritual and healing. With all the cups, that is emotional fulfillment on the highest level. Um, water representing not only your beautiful emotions, but as I said, healing can also represent spirituality and creative waters. Um, so on a higher level, and symbolically this card is on top, on some kind of higher level, soul level, higher mind, within your heart, you are really happy. You are really happy um, about taking this up. It's like rejuvenating you. And with the 10, number 10 is always representative of some kind of completions and new beginnings, some kind of achievement. You can even see that this, those little volcanoes, it's like you are bursting with energy. Something that you may have been... Um, suppressing for a long time, pressure was building up, you finally allow it to um, to be free. And that is absolutely like driving you and making you feel alive, happy. And I'll just leave it there. I, I absolutely love this reading for you. It makes me feel... Um, well, I don't want to say happy again, but that's just how it makes me feel. Happy and creative. Um, fulfilled in some kind of creation okay you see he's digging with his hands in in the ground like you are really with your hands fully in it like you are really engaged okay putting your hands into the uh, into the ground to plant your seeds so have a wonderful December please take care of yourself enjoy what is happening and I will see you soon bye